Okay guys, so get this. Suge Knight has denied signing his life rights over to Ray J. In an audio recording obtained by The Blast, the infamous hip-hop figure, who is currently incarcerated for murder, said the love and hip-hop Hollywood personality is simply in charge of all Death Row Records dealings. Yeah, I've heard about the um, article being released regarding that um, Ray J has all my rights, television, movies, books, and all that type of stuff. He don't. Ray J is not just a friend of mine, that's little brother, that's family. And I respect Ray J and his business dealings. That's why I choose him as one of the guys to deal with the music side of the future, as far as Death Row Records, anything to do Death Row, and it's great to have him because he'll be putting out this incredible album, and I heard it before. Knight confirmed he actually made his fiance, Toy Lynn Kelly, the guardian of his life rights, explaining, as far as the person who has the power of attorney, which is Toy, who is dealing with the movie, television, and a documentary. The former Death Row CEO then revealed Nick Cannon will be handling his autobiography. Nick Cannon will be doing the book personally as a writer. I know he has all the potential and the spirit to be a great writer. He is a great writer. He'll be doing my book, he said. I can say he is a trustworthy guy. I think you should take notice to it. He's probably one of the most power players in the industry today who is honest and real. He keeps his word. So what do you guys think? Is Suge Knight's life rights safe in the hands of Ray J? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our latest videos. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to hiphopdx.com.